on our Z engine. So, we will the crankshaft and we will the main bearing and we will the crankshaft bearing also. So, what happened now? We change the crankshaft, we buy new Conrad. One whole complete set of Conrad. Can you can see? Brand new Conrad, brand new Conrad. Replace damaged Conrad. Remember, you have to check Conrad them properly. A little scrape or a little hitch or anything and the, the Conrad or the, the crankshaft can cause a great problem down in the engine room. So, we are building now. So we are changing out everything. You understand? The music I play is playing next door. It's not me playing music, but I have to do my video. Um, well, basically, put in new bearings and change a couple of Conrad and things. And this is how this is where I reach now. Put on the clutch, that brand new clutch disc. Push a plate, put in a brand new clutch disc. So, I think now it's time. So, we're gonna. I find out I have a blow here, yeah? you burn. So I clean up this right now and then clean up the head. Get the head clean and polish and put on a gasket and then get moving. And this is how you set it on timing. Right now this is on timing. Number four and number one is up. You understand? So we have number four and number one up. So that's it, that's the, the timing for the, the lower part of the engine. And further on we'll show you the timing and the cam. Okay? So we'll find ourselves with a blowing head gasket. So head gasket blow. So we change head gasket now, so we are tightening up. It's a four Z E one. You understand? This is also so I don't know. But I will show you if you catch all the timing and all these things. So we replace the head gasket already. Already. So we diagnose so we have a blue in the gasket now because the water back least start bubbling. I should have shown all of that so I will show that in the next video and the next vehicle when, whenever I get in the next vehicle that if you're having a overheat problem I will show you how to diagnose. Um, I'm blowing it gasket whenever I blow in the compression or the water so we'll go further upon that for next time but now we we'll change the head gasket so we have to put them up on the right top and tighten them properly so four is ready one and this is the timing this true this because mark line up with the marker yeah. so that's the cam timing now we are going to the crankshaft now kiwi up straight up mark with this mark you can see this mark behind the bolt down here that's where it line up so you line it up right here with the keyway, with this mark. So that's how you catch the crank, the crankshaft timing down at the bottom half, and up here now for the camshaft timing line. So that's it, and that's the timing. For the four Z one. So you know we do some overall and things so I see last the top now. Put on the top is cover. Yes, yes. That's a Richie. Yeah.